Now let me talk about raises. While schools would get $190 million less next year than they got this year, the General Assembly did include a small raise for teachers and education personnel and state employees. Let me speak directly to the teachers and the state employees here in North Carolina. I support that pay raise. In fact, if you look at my budget document, I included in my budget proposal raises that were 50% larger than the ones that are in the General Assembly's budget. But here's the thing. Under this budget, while some teachers and state employees will get raises, there is no question that some educators and other state employees are going to lose their jobs because of the choices made by this General Assembly in this budget. Raises for some and pink slips for others is not the right thing, not the right direction for North Carolina. I'm not vetoing this budget to block your raises. On the contrary, I'm vetoing this budget in hopes that we can bring legislative leaders back to the table so we can increase our investments in schools and jobs and other key priorities and secure your race.